please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click on that like button if you like my video. Also click on that notification bell. Thank you. Hey beautiful people. In this video, I want to spend some time and go over the operating system. Now, of course, our focus in this entire course is Linux. And Linux is an operating system. So before we start getting into Linux, let's understand what exactly an operating system is. So as per Wikipedia, an operating system is system software that manages computer hardware and software resources and provides common services for computer programs. Or in simple words, an operating system, in short OS, is software that acts as a middleman or a bridge between computer hardware and the computer users. What other hardware, like CPU, memory, disks, and who is the computer user? You are the computer users. It provides a user interface and controls the computer hardware so the software can function. Now, which software are we talking about here? Software or applications that actually run on your computer. Now, let me ask you a question. Why do you use computer? Because you want to use certain applications, right? You want to use, for example, Microsoft Word, Excel. You want to get online. You want to use Firefox or Chrome browser. You want to use Calendar, Calculator. All those applications are the main reason you have your computer at home, right? So when you start up your computer, the very first thing that starts up is your operating system, which allows you to start or operate other applications running or installed in your computer. Okay, now let's go over the different type of operating systems. The first one is desktop operating system. These operating systems are like Microsoft Windows, Mac OS, and Linux, such as Ubuntu. They run on your regular computer or your laptop that you are using probably every day at home or in the office. Then you have server operating systems, for example, Windows Server, Linux distributions like CentOS, Red Hat, SUSE, and so on. These type of operating systems are actually run on corporate or enterprise level environment. Then mobile operating system, for example, Android, iOS, Windows Mobile. If you have Samsung phone, you have Android operating system that controlling the phone. If you have Apple phone, you have iOS operating system in it. If you have Microsoft phone, then you have Windows Mobile operating system running on it. Then embedded operating systems used in devices like routers, smart TVs, automobiles, home appliances. Then you have real-time operating systems, in short RTOS, used in critical systems like medical equipment, car ECUs, aerospace, defense, network firewalls, home security system, and so on. So I hope you have a better understanding now what exactly an operating system is. Now we will jump into Linux, which is an operating system. If you want to learn more about Linux, check out my best selling course on Linux at udemy.com or you could go straight to my website utclsolutions.com and you will find the exact same course there. 